Hi there, this is Eugene, and uh, what I'm going to do now, uh, this is the third part in a series of working with polyurethane bushings, is this bushing is uh, a little bit too long, so, so i got to take roughly 0 .7, 0 0.175 of it off. Now, to cut it, I use a razor blade, and this is just a razor blade from one of the handheld razors here, you can see it there, and uh, the big part, difficulty was getting it to uh, be mounted. So what I did is I used my cutoff holder and then I used a C-clamp to clamp it up and I put it at an angle. So I got a little bit of a spacer here underneath. I actually used just a hex key because it worked out pretty good. And it gives me a, a nice rake on there. Let's see if I can see the rake on that. And uh, I'm spinning it again at uh, 1360 RPM. Let's see if you get that in focus. Probably not right there. And uh, so we'll turn the beast on and we'll see how easy it cuts. So I've got it just a little bit below center. And you can see it come in, just kind of push it in. And it comes off really nice. You might have noticed that the uh, <laughs> my lamp fell down. You might have noticed that the uh, uh, I'll just stop it here, and the blade kind of bent out a bit as it cut, so it's got a little bit of a, a curve to it, which is fine for what I want, and that. But it uh, cuts off pretty nice and straight and even, so. So we'll see what the edge looks like here. It looks pretty decent. And that, so just wanted to show you third part in the uh, uh, videos that I've done on just working with polyurethane bushings. Thank you.